Today, the Department of Health is set to release that registration link and the phone number for eligible residents to finally book an appointment at one of the state's mass vaccination sites. The sites again, Providence and Cranston, and they're slated to open tomorrow. Alexandra Leslie has been following the vaccine rollout and the state, Alex, is withholding some of the first doses for use at those sites. Right, so a Department of Health spokesperson tells 12 News that 7,000 to 10,500 doses would go to the two sites each week, adding that as more vaccine comes in, that number will be increased. So the Department of Health Director, Dr. Nicole Alexander Scott, says that the mass vaccination sites in Cranston and at the Dunkin' Donuts Center in Providence will have the capability to vaccinate hundreds of people per hour. For now, people 75 and older, along with anyone left in phase one, like first responders, will be the only ones who could utilize these sites. But Dr. Alexander Scott says eligibility could expand soon. Adults 65 and older would be the next eligible group. We will do it as soon as we get this up and running. We will definitely want to start going that route. There's no reason to uh, hold back. It was a matter of having enough vaccine to start getting it out there. And then uh, people will see us advance the eligibility shortly. And also happening later today, the Rhode Island House of Representatives COVID-19 Vaccine Task Force is meeting. The task force set to get an update on the state's vaccine distribution process. Live in Pawtucket, Alexandra Leslie, 12 News.